For the proprioceptive and vestibular systems, there's two different components, each of which challenges the different systems. So let me explain each first, and then I'll show you how we integrate it into one exercise. So the first aspect is challenging the proprioceptive system and some vestibular as well, and it's going to be a balance progression. So the first part of the balance aspect is what I call tandem stance. So I'll show you inside first. So literally it's one foot in front of the other. Don't allow the heel to touch the toe. So you're going to be doing that. And then you're going to switch feet. And then after that, it's going to be single leg balance. So one foot to the other. Now, if you want to make that more challenging, to add an next layer to that is you can change their surface. So you can put some on the ground and then, and then, and then do it and it'll make, it'll make it more difficult. Now, for the vestibular system, balance does challenge the vestibular system. So the first part of the integration of the exercise is just doing something with, just, do, just doing pure balance. But then to challenge the vestibular system, we can add in a few things. The first thing we're gonna do here is add in head turns and then the next layer to that is head nods. And then it's combining, it's doing half head turns and half head nods. And then the last aspect is closing your eyes and really challenging your vestibular system rather than using your vision, which tends to dominate for a lot of people. And then the hardest progression is doing the head turns with eyes closed, head nods with eyes closed, head turn head nod with eyes closed. And I'll have all this written out in the article as well so you can see the full progression. But So let me give you an example. So we start out with the tandem stance here. Do that for a minute. Switch, switch sides. Do that for a minute. Once you can do that really easily, move to one foot balance for a minute. One foot balance for a minute. So it's two minutes total and then you move on to the aversion strengthening component. Once you can do that, then you move on to tandem and you integrate. You do head nods for a minute, and then you switch head nods for a minute, and then you do a single leg, head nods for a minute, head nods for a minute. Once that gets too easy, you can then do the tandem with Excuse me, last time was head, head turns, not head nods. Now it would be head nods for a minute. And you switch it, head nods for a minute. Once that's easy, move a single leg with the head nods. Minute, head nods. Once that gets easy enough, you move to tandem. And now you go 30 seconds of head turns and then 30 seconds of head nods. So a minute on this side, switch, 30 seconds of head turns, 30 seconds of head nods for a minute to one foot, 30 seconds. It's getting harder if you can't tell. Head turns, 30 of head nods, switch, 30 head turns, 30 seconds of head nods, once you're done with that, that's the first two minutes. The next minute is the aversion strengthening. 